chimpanzees are perhaps best known for being our closest relation on Earth. It's not hard to see why. We look very alike, and scientists have been able to work out that we share around 94-98% to of DNA with them. With that being said though, we're still very different. Observing these animals has given us an insight into their behaviour, and how they act in their natural environment. They've also been observed showing strong emotions and growing bonds of each other, very similar to what us humans do. Chimpanzees are known to be calm creatures, and over the years humans have been able to get close to them and even interact with them. Although it's frowned upon, some people have successfully kept them as pets, and haven't had any issues, whereas others have tried this and have felt the full strength of one of these creatures. They belong in the world where they can naturally interact with other members of their species. In fact, studies have shown this is very important for their development and behaviour. However, even in the world, they have been described as being highly territorial. Some wildlife specialists have said that if a rival chimp comes into their territory, they will have a large increase of aggression and won't be afraid to show this. One group of chimps, however, has become known for its brute strength and aggression. This chimp is known as the Billy Ape. What's interesting about this creature is that we don't know much about it, and at one point in time it wasn't even believed to have existed. Many scientists and researchers suggested that the Billy Ape was nothing more than a myth, or even a made-up cryptid. But when researchers made their way into the Billy Forest which can be found in the Democratic Republic of the Congo, they discovered that this ape is very much real. In fact, the locals of this region would talk about a large ape that inhabited the area, but the difference with this ape when compared to others is that it seemed larger and more aggressive. Researchers have been able to find out that the Billy Ape is closely related to the Eastern Chimpanzee. While explorers were making their way through the region, they were able to find out there are two different groups of these apes. There are some that have become known as the Tree Climbers, and this is because when humans are around, they can be observed quickly climbing a tree and looking for cover. This is because the locals of the region use darts to bring them down. If one of these chimps are hit with these darts, they succumb to their injuries. This is because the darts are usually covered with a type of poison. What's interesting though is the other group of billy apes are known as the lion killers. These have gotten the name because they are much larger in size compared to the tree climbers and when the locals have tried to hit them with the darts, it has no effect on them. One of the first encounters with these Billy Apes goes back to 1996. This was when Carl Amann, a Swiss photographer, visited the Billy region. At the time, he had no idea that the Billy Apes inhabited the region, and was actually looking for gorillas. While walking through the dense forested area, he wasn't able to locate any gorillas but he was able to find a strange looking skull. It was strange due to the fact that it was around the same size of a chimpanzee, but had a prominent crest that was very similar to that of a gorilla. Fast forward over five years later and researchers were able to conduct more studies in the region of the Congo. One scientist said that while in the region they felt unsafe as these apes didn't seem faced by humans. In fact, they even described one instance where one of the apes ran towards them. This wasn't done with the normal vocalisations either, which made the scientists more on edge as they had done this with confidence rather than trying to call their bluff. However, as these apes approached, something seemed off. As when they made eye contact, they seemed confused and slowly started to walk off. The scientists and researchers described these apes as being much larger than a normal chimp not just in height, but in overall bulk. One thing that researchers have picked up on while studying the apes is that their behaviour seems off. For example, one researcher described them as behaving more like gorillas than chimpanzees. This could be seen in the way they build their nests and interact with the environment around them. Another thing they said is that their behaviour towards humans is much different compared to other apes. There is no fear when they meet us face to face. They don't show any sign of feeling intimidated. For example, when humans have gotten close to a silverback gorilla, they will usually thump their hands on the ground or even charge in order to show dominance. 
there isn't any of that with these aims. Which in fact is more frightening as they don't see humans as a friend. This shows confidence in the fact that these apes don't feel like they need to show off in front of us, as clearly we wouldn't be a match for them if they did want to take us on. Although these apes look much bigger in real life, this was confirmed when researchers were able to study remains of their skulls. It turned out that one individual had a skull measuring over 225mm. When compared to a common chimpanzees who have an average skull of 185 to 200 millimeters, this gives you an idea of how much larger these creatures are. The truth is that this moment in time, researchers and scientists don't really know much about this elusive creature. One interesting idea that's been put forward is that these creatures could be behind some of the local tales of large humanoids. The locals have described seeing large humanoids that they've described as looking different from typical chimps, and it's now believed that Billy Ape is responsible for the sightings. In fact, recently we talked about a bizarre creature known as the spiny back chimpanzee. This mysterious humanoid has been reportedly seen in the Democratic Republic of Congo, and it's suggested by some theorists that the Billy Ape is closely related to these creatures. This ape is described as being large in size, having a broad face, not making much noise, and not being afraid of humans. Unlike other cryptids in the area, the alleged sightings of this mysterious creature are quite recent. The creature has been around for the last few decades and everybody who encounters it describes the same thing. According to one encounter by a Navy officer who wanted to remain anonymous, his unit encountered three strange bipedal chimpanzees. The group of chimpanzees was trying to take down other animals, they were four to six feet tall and had a grey colour. However, the most distinctive feature of these chimpanzees was the series of spines on their back. Whenever these mysterious animals became agitated, the spines on their back stood up like a porcupine's quills. The Navy officer also stated that his team members made a three minutes video of these strange animals, but that video was never released to the public and still remains a military secret. The officers did not tell the exact location of the sighting. However, it's believed the sighting was made somewhere near the Lake Tanganyika in the Democratic Republic of the Congo. Spiny back chimpanzees is one of the strangest creatures ever reported, and the researchers believe the jungles of Africa could potentially host hundreds of unexplored species. The spiny back chimpanzee could be an undiscovered species with very little population, and could very well be extinct by now. Some have linked this creature to the Billy Ape, and have suggested it's the same thing. The only thing that's different about this creature and the Billy Ape is that of the spines. However, as some have pointed out, the Billy Ape was once thought to be a cryptid and not a real creature. But fast forward a couple of decades and scientists were able to prove that it was in fact a real animal. Some have suggested that the same thing could happen with the spiny back chimpanzee. There are many areas of the Congo that haven't been explored, and somewhere out there could be lurking a species of apes that match the description of the spiny back chimpanzees. As of today, the Congo is one of the places that has reported the most mysterious creatures. Some have even given it the name of Earth's real-life Jurassic Park. Another famous creature that's yet identified by science is that of the Mikeli Membe, or known in its native language as the one who stops the flow of rivers. The design of this creature is similar to that of a sauropod dinosaur, a tall dinosaur-like creature with a long neck and a larger flowing tail to match. The size of its body is similar to that of a hippopotamus up to an elephant, and has a neck reportedly longer than 8 meters in length. The reports out of the Congo River Basin claim the creature stands more than 50 feet in length, and hides in the thick frosted locations all throughout the northernmost part of the Congo. Legends and sightings of the creature go back thousands of years according to the native tribes in the region, and reports of the creature range all the way up to the modern day, with even a group of French priests that travelled through the region confirming the sighting of this modern day dinosaur. So my question to you guys is what do you make of the Billy Ape? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comment section below, and help us by growing this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries.
Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.